A condition in which a wound occurs on the skin or mucous membrane and easily bleeds is called an ulcer. Even if these ulcers heal, scars usually remain. Ulcers often form on the lining of the stomach or intestines, duodenum. Ulcers are caused by an imbalance in digestive juices or damage to the stomach lining. If left untreated, ulcers can burrow into the stomach wall, causing perforated ulcers or bleeding ulcers in the blood vessels, ultimately leading to very painful complications. They can cause various signs and symptoms, including Abdominal pain, this is the most common symptom of an ulcer. It typically presents as a dull, burning, or gnawing pain in the abdomen, often between the breastbone and belly button. The pain can come and go, lasting for minutes to hours and may be worse when the stomach is empty or at night. Heartburn, a burning sensation in the chest, often occurring after meals or when lying down, can be a sign of an ulcer. Flu symptoms, there may be flu-like symptoms such as fatigue, fever, and nausea. Inexplicable hunger, you can feel a severe hunger within a few hours after eating enough. This is not because you are truly hungry, but because of ulcerative pain caused by increased digestive juices. Nausea and vomiting, some individuals with ulcers may experience nausea or vomiting, particularly if the ulcer is causing irritation or obstruction in the digestive tract. Loss of appetite, ulcers can lead to a decreased desire to eat due to abdominal discomfort or feelings of fullness. Unintended weight loss, as a result of decreased appetite and potential difficulties with digestion, some people with ulcers may experience weight loss. Bloody or dark stools, ulcers can cause bleeding in the digestive tract, which may result in black, terry stools, melena, or stools with bright red blood. However, blood in the stool can also be a sign of other gastrointestinal conditions and should always be evaluated by a healthcare professional. Fatigue. Chronic blood loss from an ulcer can lead to anemia, which may cause fatigue or weakness. Difficulty swallowing. If an ulcer develops in the esophagus, it may cause difficulty or pain when swallowing. Chest pain. Ulcers in the esophagus can sometimes cause chest pain that may be mistaken for heart-related pain, although this is less common. Bloating. Some individuals with ulcers may experience bloating, particularly after meals. It's important to note that not everyone with an ulcer will experience all of these symptoms, and some individuals may not have any symptoms at all. Symptoms can be improved by changing one's lifestyle, such as, smaller meals are better, and your dinner should be eaten 3-4 hours before bedtime. If you're overweight, you should lose weight. Limit your alcohol intake to the prescribed amount. Quit smoking. Tomatoes, chocolate, fatty foods, and spicy foods should all be avoided as triggers. Treatment and prevention strategies for ulcers typically depend on the underlying cause of the ulcer, which can include factors such as infection with Helicobacter pylori bacteria, prolonged use of nonsteroidal anti-inflammatory drugs, NSAIDs, excessive alcohol consumption, smoking, and stress. If you experience symptoms suggestive of an ulcer, such as abdominal pain, heartburn, or changes in stool color, seek medical attention promptly for evaluation and treatment. Thank you for watching. Press the like button and subscribe for more health content.